All right, let's wow. talk impact day today. 4029 meteorologist Robert Sir joining us again, and uh, no science fiction here. No. Tomorrow's going to get ugly, huh? Yeah, I'm the bearer of bad news. Yeah. We kept saying it was a changing forecast, and now we're starting to get a hammer on exactly what's going to happen this week, and it could be sloppy, unfortunately. We've made tomorrow and Tuesday severe days at the moment for many, many reasons. First, we are going to see several rounds of snow, sleet, and freezing rain, mainly sleet and freezing rain across northwest Arkansas as well as the River Valley. Now the best chance for uh, more impactful freezing rain I think will be River Valley and east, especially south of Fort Smith and toward the Little Rock area where they could have big time ice problems. But regardless, it only takes a glaze of ice to create dangerous travel and the possibility of power outages. As I said earlier, two different winter weather advisories in effect, northwest Arkansas 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. tomorrow. And then for the River Valley, 6 p.m. Monday through 6 a.m. Wednesday, meaning all day Tuesday, uh, the River Valley will be under that winter weather advisory. We are expecting all sorts of hazards, not so much with the accumulating snow, but sleet and freezing rain will be the two main players here, and they could have big time impacts on our travel. Now, right now, temperature is certainly cold enough for accumulating snow, but higher up in the atmosphere, it's warmer than this, which is what's going to lead to that icy mess. Upper 20s, lower 30s, Northwest Arkansas, upper 30s, lower 40s in the River Valley. Now, here's the big picture. You can see that front still sliding by. More moisture to our south. Some of this might creep up into our area tonight. A little bit of freezing drizzle, some sleet pellets. What's happening tonight? Not that big of a deal. Shouldn't create a lot of problems. That's why it's just an impact night. But as you'll see here, as we go hour by hour, a larger slug of moisture arrives tomorrow. So tonight, yeah, a little bit of freezing drizzle, freezing mist out there. Coach your windshield, handrails might be a little bit slick. By tomorrow morning, that's mostly gone and things are nice and quiet, but big slug of moisture rolls in here Monday afternoon and evening. Sleet and freezing rain, uh, probably rain changing to freezing rain in the River Valley, and even a little bit of snow possible you get up toward the Missouri border. That's out of here by Monday evening. We get another break before another round of precipitation rolls in here. Kind of the same thing. Snow, sleet, and freezing rain kind of stacked on the top of each other. But notice the River Valley, all of these events, basically all freezing rain Monday and on Tuesday. And we'll get another break on Wednesday before possibly just some plain rain rolls in here. In terms of where you're at, what you could see, Northwest Arkansas, basically snow and sleet. In the middle, uh, the middle part of Northwest Arkansas, into northern parts of the River Valley, sleet and freezing rain. Mostly freezing rain south of I-40 and then way south. Uh, just plain rain for the most part. In terms of accumulations, only takes a glaze in northwest Arkansas. This is through Wednesday at 6 a.m. Couple hundredths here, higher numbers in the River Valley, crippling numbers the further south and east you get for the freezing rain. We'll also see sleet pile up in some locations as well, but at least you get some traction on sleet. And then maybe just a little bit of snow here across northwest Arkansas, north of Highway 412, and especially once you get into southwest Missouri. Lows tonight will be in the 20s and lower 30s. Temperatures go almost nowhere tomorrow, upper 20s and lower to mid 30s in the River Valley. There's a look at the extended forecast, which features those messy days, more rain chances and the possibility of more slick chances Wednesday and maybe Thursday. It depends. Still, we'll get through Monday and Tuesday first before we worry about the potential for Thursday and Friday. But by the end of the week, sunshine and warmer temperatures. River Valley about the same thing. Definite slick spots. If you have traveled to the east uh, toward the capital region this week, you're going to want to really pay attention to the forecast because we could be talking about widespread power outages as we get toward the Little Rock uh, area in those places. Stay with us. We've got an update with Meredith Mulkey. She's going to tell you how the Lady Hogs did on the basketball court after the break.